Hey guys and welcome to Words of Scale and boy how you're gonna like this video that I'm about to show you today. So under one of my previous videos there was a comment by a subscriber I guess who said he has this magic prompt that gives him 90 SEO score in NeuroWriter time after time and everybody of course kept asking him to share the prompt and he didn't respond for some reason. And I thought I would give it a try. Uh, I must say that I am nowhere near 90, <laughs> but I was, I managed to get an 82 SEO score on my first try. So I first want to explain the logic. So the logic was as follows. I first went to Neuron Writer. I picked my favorite testing word, which is Candox It Long End. I chose the three competitors with the most optimized content. So Euro 1, Euro 2 and Euro 3. These are the three URLs with the most optimized SEO score. Then I copied the visible terms. Right like so. List of terms. I filtered out everything and left basic and extended terms. And then I went straight to chat GPT and ran the following prompt. I want to paste three URLs and a list of already extracted LSI keywords. Can you reverse engineer how they were extracted and suggest a prompt to extract them? <laughs> and I didn't uh, expect anything going forward, but the response was sure, I can help with that. Please provide the three URLs and tell and the list of the LSI keywords that were extracted from them. That's what I did. I provided the three URLs, then the list of keywords from NeuronWriter, and it used WebPilot to access the uh, URL, so you need the WebPilot active. And this is what I got back, and this is where all the magic happens. After examining the content of the three provided URLs, the keywords you have provided are likely extracted based on their main topic and related subtopics discussed in the article. The main topic is candoxid long end, and the subtopics include the health benefits, blah, blah, blah. Here's the breakdown of how these keywords might have been extracted. Main keywords, subtopics, additional keywords. And this is the actual prompt. To extract similar LSI keywords from other articles, you could use a prompt like, and this is a prompt, and this prompt is going to be in our prompts library. And yeah, what I did next was uh, I asked ChatGPT to run a similarity check and the percentage of overlap between the original LSI keywords and the LSI keywords that were extracted by the prompt. And it didn't work, like it tried to do the Wolfram thingy, but it failed, so I went to the good old playground and did the same and surprisingly it ran some weird python script and it came back with the uh, the percentage of overlap of 70%. So what NeuronWriter extracted and what the prompt extracted overlap by 70%. So there is a 70% overlap. So I decided to test this uh, and uh, actually write an article. So I went to agility which is my favorite AI copywriter of choice. And you can get a 15% off, which is an exclusive discount to our community. I used the create outline function and chose number of headings of five. And I pasted the keywords here. And this is the article that I got back. So the article with all the LSI keywords from ChatGPT. And then I straight pasted them. I will do it just so you know. This is not rigged. I'll be deleting all the content here. So I pre-populated the meta. And again, Control C, Control V. And the score is 82. And I did not include the FAQs, which I could have. And so the score uh, could have been even higher. So this is amazing. <laughs> I, I'm not saying you don't need NeuroWriter anymore. Uh, I use NeuroWriter every day. It's my favorite SEO optimization tool for LSI keywords. And what I'm also not saying is that uh, this prompt is and all be all. 
you think I think you should test it for your keywords in your niche and maybe the ChatGPT will return another prompt or slightly modified version of the prompt. But I think this is a big deal. And I pretty sure you will appreciate the value of this video. And if you have, like, share, subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll be sure to see you next time. Cheers.